Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Pisces, October 30, 2021. There can be supportive people or channels for expressing your affections today. Even so, some pressure can build as Mars and Pluto head toward a square. Mars will enter your sign on the 30th, but it continues to transit your privacy sector until then. It's a good time to clear the decks for new beginnings. Today, unresolved tension or resentment can lead to regrettable words or poor timing. It's not very easy to ask for what you want directly right now. You might hope instead that others intuit your needs, but this leaves you vulnerable to allowing others' actions, or inactions, to decide your mood. Do your best to ease and settle your mind. Being kind to yourself may involve letting a matter go, as challenging as that may be. Rather than waste time on resentment, aim to use frustration to motivate you to improve something in your life. Playing Mr. Nice Guy slash Ms. Nice Gal at work gets you far, but it may not be getting you quite as far as you truly would like to go. You would like to strive for something more something bigger. Use the next four weeks to evaluate your approach. Today's aspect makes you feel right at home, figuratively speaking, quite possibly literally as well. This doesn't mean you will feel fantastic or that everything will work out perfectly. It simply presents a particular energy wherein your true nature can be noticed. The key to enjoying this transit is relaxation. Do the things that truly relax you. This might involve yoga, getting plenty of rest, and drinking lots of water. Give yourself the things you need on a physical level, and your emotions will be easier to understand. You have reached the last full day of your old solar year just as the noise from the last few days subsides and it is easier to hear yourself think. Before the sun returns to Scorpio to begin your birthday month and new solar year, make the most of any chance today to reflect or to just spend time navel gazing. Your subconscious can do a lot of the processing of the past on its own as long as you don't channel all your focus into overthinking things. The more you can rest body, mind and soul the more your subconscious can get on with the job it is equipped to do. As is always the case when the moon returns to your relationship sector each month, as well as a chance to become more emotionally engaged it will connect with Pluto in your communication sector. This is a familiar routine that plays out every month and is a valuable chance to keep the communication lines open. The difference this time is that on both the communication and relationship fronts the moon is tapping into a sense of anticipation as it picks up on positive conditions ahead. Take a breath, and don't make any hasty decisions. Today's all or nothing square between both of your planetary rulers, Mars and Pluto, is not for the faint of heart. Whether you're single or already taken, Mars sizzling transit through your secretive house of closure, dreams, and all things behind the scenes continues to highlight themes surrounding your unconscious behavior patterns. Your shadow side is being activated, and this becomes emphasized upon Mars square to your modern ruler, Pluto, by your third house of communication, thought processes, and immediate surroundings. In simpler terms, you can run but you can't hide, there's only so much you can repress.